Today, it's Oli Kusunnu. Dear Brainiac, can you microwave an egg with a hundred mobile phones? Good question. Let's get on with it. It's been well documented that mobile phones do emit radiation, radiation that does generate heat. But how much? Enough to boil an egg? Well, not with one phone, but with the concentrated exposure of a hundred mobiles, all going off together? Well, let's see. One hundred phones to boil the egg, one hundred phones to dial those ones. Took a lot of robbing to set this experiment up. He dials a different number into each phone and they all have to be ready to send at the same time. The egg is in place. We've got a hundred mobile phones around it. We've got a further 100 mobile phones ready to ring them. So let's microwave that egg. He's taken them all off Antiphone. They'll ring as quickly as he dials them. His fingers work furiously. He's desperate for his breakfast. You can see why we got a member of the public to do this. Frankly, we couldn't be asked with all this hard work. These digital cell phones send out compressed information at 50 pulses of electromagnetic radiation per second. Each one generates 2 watts of energy. By a factor of 100, the question is, does he want it soft or hard boiled? But the proof of the pudding, or the egg, is in the eating. With a plate of soldiers at the ready, let's hope it's not overdone. Well, it's a little runny for my tastes. Looks like Ollie will have to go somewhere else for breakfast. 100 phones don't produce enough microwaves even to warm it up. His name is Ollie Kusunu. He wanted to know if you could microwave an egg using 100 mobile phones. The answer? Nah. I can do science, me.